Hey you guys, what's up? Um, this is uh, the Lyft and Uber rideshare LA. Um, what's up guys? I know I haven't been on in a while. I think the last video I shot was uh, the $500 in, in two hours, or 80 rides in two hours and shit. That was a mistake from uh, Lyft's, Lyft's side. Um, but yeah, I wanted to let you guys know what I was up to now. So maybe like two, three weeks after that, my last video, um, my unemployment was approved because I had gotten laid off from my job, reason why I started Lyft and Uber. So my unemployment got approved. So I stopped giving Lyft rides. Um, I stopped giving rides um, because, you know, it's, I was making the same amount of money as I would in unemployment and everything, but um, all right, check it out. So in my last video, I also mentioned that I started doing something else besides Lyft and Uber. Um, and then uh, I did do it. Um, I continued with Lyft, with Lyft and Uber for, for I would say three weeks after, right? And then um, I started doing this other thing called DoorDash and Postmates. DoorDash and Postmates uh, and Grubhub, they're food delivery services like Uber Eats, but I prefer doing DoorDash and Postmates. Um, I started um, pretty much the last, uh, after the video, my last video, I just kept I switched, completely switched from Lyft and Uber to DoorDash and Postmates uh, because I could do simultaneous orders. At the same time, I think DoorDash is $5 per delivery plus tips and DoorDash is, um, Postmates is $4.25 plus tips and distance um, and time. So that, that, that worked out very well for me. Uh, DoorDash and, and besides, I didn't like really dealing with passengers and all this shit that's going on. So that's why I just stuck with uh, DoorDash and Postmates like the remainder of the three weeks before my unemployment kicked in. And then, um, yeah, um, I really like DoorDash and Postmates, especially in the, you know, in LA, that shit's cracking. Depending on what areas you guys do, <laughs> you might find it worth it. Some of you might not find it worth it. Um, I really like the Torrens, Hermosa Beach, Redondo Beach area in LA. Not so much the downtown area when it comes to delivering food. Um, but yeah, people are nice. You know, you could just kick back, don't have to worry about anything. No, no passengers or anything like that, which is the reason why I liked DoorDash and Postmates. Um, and I stopped doing Lyft and Uber. Um, and then, like again, you know, after that, I got unemployment. So I just wrote out my unemployment for like about a month. And then I got a cool job. Um, I'm a lab facilities manager here at uh, a company in Inglewood. And now I'm working full time, so I no longer need to do Uber, Lyft, or Dash or anything like that. Um, I could do it if I want to, I'm still active. I could do it if I want to, um, but I'm cool. You know, I'd, I'd rather not waste my gas miles. I just wanna check out the, the field, I guess you guys could say, the Uber, Lyft platforms. Um, I want to check out the DoorDash and Postmates platforms and between both of those uh, like rideshare and delivering food I would rather much rather deliver food um, it's just more kickback you don't deal with all you know with passengers you could just kick it smoke bowls in your car listen to music bump it and just deliver food um, and I would make more money doing that um, waste less less miles less gas make more money um, I just found it more profitable, more profitable like that. Um, but thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for subscribing to my channel. Thank you guys for the support. Um, I still have my referral links down below in case you do want to give these platforms a try. You know, it always helps me out, make extra income, um, and you can make extra income as well. Um, but thank you guys for watching and peace out. Stay tuned. Please subscribe. I'll keep you guys posted on what I'm doing. Maybe if I'll go for a Lyft or Uber ride or DoorDash or Postmates drop off deliveries and stuff um amazon has one called prime now and then they have a uh, amazon flex which is 18 bucks an hour for all you independent entrepreneurs out there who want to grind and make that money um i'm the same way you know but now i'm a nine to five guy and <laughs> it's just i did that as my unemployment kicked in so i could just get some cash and stuff and then now i have a full-time job from monday through friday nine to five
but all right thank you guys for watching stay tuned and please subscribe referral links down below uh, you guys know what to do thank you guys peace